Welcome to Shift by Bacardi. Oh, Hello everyone. It's around 9.30 in the morning. We're here in beautiful uh, Victoria, BC. I'm Mike Norbury from Little Jumbo Bar. And this is my Bacardi Shift. I'd like to give a, a shout out to Bacardi for uh, thinking of me and uh, allowing me to take you through this segment, which is called Cocktail Preppers. So, without further ado, uh, why don't we get into the kitchen? A little bit sleepy here. Not really a morning person, as most of you other bartenders aren't either. To start my day, I do a little uh, computer time, a little social media, check some emails, and have a nice warm cup of coffee that my roommates usually prepare for me every morning. The next part of my day consists of a little exercise, a little yoga, oh, downward dog, and uh, I believe in stretching, you know, getting the blood flowing. That uh, brings me to my next part of the day. I believe in getting outside, getting fresh air. One of my favorite things to do is ride my bike along the shoreline out towards Victoria Golf Club. It's a beautiful little ride, but always remember, safety first. I got it. I got it. I'm gonna uh, build this guy up here and uh, have a quick little lunch and then hit the showers. Stay tuned for the cocktail next. Okay, so we're showered, we smell good, we're well fed, we're on our way to work. Except work is in my kitchen today. So to touch on you know, my routine of trying to eat healthy, trying to work out, you know, trying to keep a balanced lifestyle, I wanna do that in this cocktail. So I've chosen to use Saint Germain elderflower liqueur, a product built on entrepreneurship that is a delicious elderflower liqueur that's lower ABV. I'm gonna make you a spritz style cocktail. Okay, so to start with this spritz drink, I'm gonna use a blueberry, orange zest, and cinnamon shrub. Equal parts blueberries, equal parts sugar that you muddle into a paste for an oleosacrum. You then use equal parts to the sugar, apple cider vinegar, some orange zest, and some cinnamon. Just about a half orange and a couple dashes from a shaker will do just fine. Stir all that up, let it sit for a couple days in your fridge. Fine strain it out. If you don't have a fine strainer or a chinois or all that professional equipment at home, a coffee filter and just like a regular pasta strainer will do just fine. And your finished product should look just like that. So in this cocktail, I'm going to use a half ounce of the blueberry cinnamon and orange zest shrub. All right, next up, St. Germain elderflower liqueur. Floral, delicious, bartender's ketchup. This is a brand built on entrepreneurship and I love to use it in my cocktails. I'm gonna do an equal parts elderflower liqueur St. Germain in this shrub. So far, you know, you have your blueberries, your cinnamon, your uh, apple cider vinegar, all good for digestion antioxidants. We have our uh, St. Germain elderflower liqueur, which is good for low ABV cocktails, big flavor, florality. Then we're gonna add um, two ounces of soda. We're gonna use some sparkling wine. It doesn't really matter what you use in a spritz as you're really trying to um, display the liqueur and the shrubs and all the other flavors you got going on. I do prefer a drier style sparkling wine to balance this cocktail. So I'm just gonna top that up in the glass. Probably good there. Then we can uh, add some ice, a couple cubes, maybe more than a couple. Maybe. I've chosen to use a uh, big red wine glass. I love the idea of spritzes to be used in these glasses, you know? Make you think of outside, sipping on a patio. Anyways, that should be good there. And I'm gonna garnish this guy with a blood orange, dehydrated. So this is a nice cocktail um, garnish that you can make at home. Uh, you, if you just put a couple, you know, slices of orange or lime or lemon in the, in the uh, oven, you're good to go. I'm gonna give this a little spritz. And by a little spritz, I mean a little stir. 
And there you have it. I'm gonna call this one Mr. Blue Sky. As uh, here in Victoria, we have tons of beautiful sunny weather. Cheers to everyone out east.